Here we are with the number four WBO rated contender, Joel, Joel Bronker, right? Yes, Joel Bronker. Joel Bronker, uh, coming all the way from Australia. Yeah, definitely it's good to come out here and fight again. It's the second time around and hopefully I put on another good performance and get some people to watch me and hopefully like it. Now, uh, you recently inked or signed with uh, Gary Shaw Promotions? Yes. So he's going he's gonna to be looking after me now and that's what we want to do and he's the one that's going to bring me the big fights and that's what I want. How do you feel with signing with somebody such as uh, Gary Shaw? It, it's good. It's uh, obviously someone's starting to notice my credentials and um, I can't complain about that and just hopefully now I'll just keep on getting some some good W's and everything will work well from there. Now it seems like there's a lot of Australians in the house uh, with uh, Daniel Gill, the, you know, the champ here, and then you're on the undercard. Uh, you guys brought a lot of Australians with y'all? Yeah, it's good. Um, I'm a small team. I only bring bring a few. I, I don't want no big, but they've got their boys, but I'll just stick with mine, um, and then that does me good. But it is good that, you know, you're fine with the champs, so those other Australians will be able to pull for you too. Yeah, most definitely. I know they're all going to be back with me 100%, so... That does help, which definitely would be in my, my, my benefit anyway. Now, uh, Lou, Australia's been making a little name for themselves in the boxing scene. How, how do you feel about Australia's fight scene at this time? I think we're very strong with a lot of talent coming out of Australia. and I love the sport, so the more the more the better. I want to see Australia do better and build the sport in Australia and get something out of the sport that's done so much for me. 26-0, and 0, number four WBO rated contender. How does that feel? Uh, it's good. It's... um. I want, obviously, I want to get higher, but it's it's great to get to that stage and to realise at least I've got that far, and hopefully we can keep on going and get further from there. Uh, what do you know about your opponent? It seems like you got a pretty good record, 28-4. Uh, what do you know about him? Uh, nothing too much. I, I know he's a good fighter, he's a good southpaw, and obviously he's going to come to fight, and, but that's what I want. Um, I'm only going to learn from that, and the bigger the better fights is better, the best thing for me. Without giving away the game plan, uh, what, are you like, what are you looking to do tomorrow night? Me, I don't have to, I just fight, I just, the same as every other fight, I come fight my fight and I, I work it out from round one, what's going on, and then we'll go from there. You look pretty relaxed, you look like you're already on weight, you don't look dehydrated at all, you, unlike with some of these other guys looking around, running around, still trying to make weight. Um, You've been on weight for how long already? I've been on weight, I woke up this morning on weight, so everything's good, I had breakfast, I was still late, and um, I was still fattening up, of course, as everyone <laughs> does, right. but, but uh, it's good, I'm, I'm comfortable, I'm relaxed, I just to get the job done, and... And I'll get back home to Australia. You look very relaxed. Well, we look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Anything you got to say to the fans, you know, Australian fans or boxing fans out there? All the fans out there now watching me, uh, I hope you enjoy what you see and you can follow me along along the journey and I uh, hope you enjoy everything that I can do. Yeah, I'll be on the lookout for him, Joel. Aussie Bronker, number four, undefeated. Australian in the house.